Tonight, the law enforcement community across the state of Wisconsin in mourning after a St. Croix County deputy is killed in the line of duty. Thanks for joining us. I'm Melissa Langben. And I'm Brad Hansen. Deputy Katie Leasing was fatally shot over the weekend while responding to a call of a drunk driver. News 9's Natalie Sapila is live in Wausau with how local officers are supporting each other through the tragedy. Well, Brad, Melissa, here at the Wausau Police Department, like so many other departments across the state, it's a tight-knit community. And officers here tell me when police lose one of their own, even across the state, it's felt by them all. Sadness, fear, and frustration across the state after the death of Deputy Katie Lysing. Just the fact that another officer in Wisconsin has been killed is something that's incredibly concerning. Lysing's death marking the third death of an officer in Wisconsin in five weeks after the deaths of Shatek officer Emily Breidenbach and Cameron officer Hunter Scheel. And to see another one happen with a, in less than a month's time is obviously something that shakes everybody up. The past year, 2022, saw no officer deaths in Wisconsin, according to the Officer Down Memorial page. In a Facebook post, the Wausau Police Department sang in part, quote, this needs to stop. It's not us versus them, that we are there. We are a member of the community. Our families are members of this community, and we're all in it together. Wausau Police Captain Ben Graham says moments like these have them reevaluating how they're keeping each other safe in the field. But at the end of the day, every officer knows the risks. In this line of work, we run to the danger. And so we know that inherent in everything that we do is the potential for an officer to lose their life. Something that law enforcement is really good at is evaluating things that happen both here locally as well as across the country. And then taking those things that we learn bringing them back and trying to provide tactics or skills around them. Sheriff Chad Billups says it's important for the St. Croix community to feel supported at this time. And I think that it's, it's important for those officers in Barron County and St. Croix County to know that not, not only do their, their, their law enforcement family have their back, but their community will. Funeral arrangements for Deputy Lacing have not been announced, but both the Sheriff's Office and the Wausau Police Department say they'll be there no matter what. Live in Wausau, I'm Natalie Sapila, News 9, WOW.